today we'll discuss about sports nutrition pyramid there are three components of the sports nutrition pyramid the first component is balanced diet balanced by a diet fulfills the requirement of both energy and nutrients the second component is sports specific nutrition strategies sports specific nutrition strategies optimize recovery and performance and the last one i supplement and supplement it's something that supplement the diet so the first one balanced diet balanced diet we can say athlete is taking balanced diet if that is taking diet from all food groups if an athlete is taking diet from fruits from vegetables from milk from meat from starch and from oil fats then we can say that athlete is taking the balanced diet balanced diet sport active and healthy lifestyle it fulfills sufficient energy intake and it also provides adequate macronutrients like carbohydrates like proteins and fats it also provides sufficient fluid and it prevents from dehydration and the most important balanced diet also fulfills the requirement of micronutrients like all micronutrients uh, like calcium iron magnesium zinc in athletes the requirements of some micronutrients like uh, calcium and iron increase but as total energy requirement is increasing so when athletes take increased energy requirement from the balanced diet then the requirement of these micronutrients like calcium and iron automatically fulfilled and a balanced diet is also uh, limited in added sugar and saturated fats okay when an athlete do not follow the balanced diet when athlete takes energy deficient diet for a long time then it can lead to relative energy deficiency syndrome that is the red syndrome and the relative energy deficiency syndrome can affect the athlete's performance the second component is sports specific nutrition sports specific nutrition optimizes performance and recovery sports specific nutrition strategies must be followed by athlete because sports specific nutrition strategies can help the athlete to meet the specific goals of that exercise can meet the competition goals can meet the exercise or performance goals like timing of nutrients in take is very important for example in take of high quality protein immediately after the exercise is important and in take of carbohydrates during exercise will benefit the exercise in take of carbohydrates during exercise will improve the performance sports specific nutrition can be normal diet like a bowl of yogurt but sports specific nutrition products are developed that fulfill the nutrition requirements that provides optimum nutrition like hydration drinks energy bars and protein shakes the last segment the last component of sports of athlete's diet and sports nutrition pyramid is supplements supplement is something that supplement the diet athlete can take supplements but they must not replace the supplements from with the balanced diet balanced diet is the foundation of the athlete's diet they must focus initially on the balanced diet and sports specific nutrition and at the end if needed supplements should be added in their diet supplements should be backed up by science supplements should be backed up by science and should be discussed with experts before starting it should be discussed with dietitians some supplements that are backed up by science that are actually based on research are creatine caffeine and beta alanine we'll discuss in our coming videos in detail about the nutrition requirements 
thanks for watching see you in the next video